Inlet, so the bottom of the Rochdale Canal, today was the day to take a look. Lot 92 at Castlefield in Manchester has been drained for essential maintenance work, as Eunice Muller reports. On the roadside, Lock 92 on the Rochdale Canal has looked better, but of interest is below ground level. So this is about five and a half metres down to the bed of this lock, onto that uh, bedrock floor that we said was unusual. The Canal and River Trust, a charity responsible for the 200-year-old canal, has drained the chamber for essential works. So it's a fantastic piece of our heritage, but they take a bit of a packet. They've got water in them, and the water's raised and lowered constantly each day, and that year in, year out. So they really, they just need that little bit of attention. Two lock gates are being repaired at lock 92 and lock 88. The last time volunteers were down here was in the early 70s. Ian McCarthy was one of them. This was a hidden little gem in Manchester, which was totally closed off to the public. And um, now we have a canal that's open to the public. Uh, the towpaths is a, a thoroughfare that people can use. Boats are now using it. Old coins, a mobile phone, and a Game Boy, just some of the valuables found. From this lock alone, the team have removed 42 tonnes of debris and silt. Incredibly, that's around half the amount from last time. And we thought it'd be a great opportunity to, to get down there, and uh, we enjoyed it, didn't we? Yeah. You're literally in a canal. It's not like, you know it hits full of water, but then you go down there and you see how much litters it. The tranquility you find here is being matched by improvements to the canal itself. In a smaller BBC Northwest tonight, Manchester.